Hello, today we will talk about uh, separate sheets. Separate sheets, that means you will use any kind of programs like Excel. How I will open Excel, I will go search EX. It will bring for you the app. You will click on it like that. And now uh, you will wait for it. You will choose a blank workbook. Okay, just a quick revision about that. Each letter, it means it's a column. He is a column. So the columns are named with letters, okay? And the numbers represent the row. So each number, it's a row. The intersection between the letter column and the number row, it makes a cell. It's a cell. Every cell, it has address. It has an address. For example, this is the active cell right now. The address of this cell is E, because it's in the column E2. So the address is E2 for this cell. Another example, for example, this one, C5, C5, and so on. OK, let's start fill um, a, a table so we can um, mention more things. Yeah, a month. Make it uh, January. Next. So you can use the, the, the keyboard arrow to move between the cells or the, your mouse. It's up to you. July. OK, now I want to make it uh, rainy. Next. Snowy. Next. Sunny. Next. Cloudy. Okay, I prefer that you start filling the table with me. 19, 5, 12, 26, 0, 14, Five, four. Okay, now my table is ready. First of all, I want you to find the cell address of Snowy. The cell address of Snowy. Where is it? Here is a Snowy. This is the address, the cell of Snowy. So, what is the cell address of Snowy? C one. It's on C one. Now I want you to find for me the cell. Uh, C3. Where is C3? I'm in the column C, but I have to move on to row 3. C3. So it's 0. The value 0 on the cell C3. C3. Okay. Uh, next. Uh, how many columns on this uh, workbook right now, on this uh, separate sheet? How many columns? We have to count. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I used 5 columns uh, on this uh, separate sheets. How many rows I used? One, two, three. So I have three rows and five columns. Okay, mm, now I want to go to the cell B2. Here is B and two, so this one. Okay, I want to change the value. I have it five, I want to make it 10. Just from your keyboard, type 10. It will change automatically. Okay, uh, then what I want, ah, okay. I, will, I wanted to highlight the month from A1 to E2. That means I want to highlight uh, the month of January. Then I will go insert. I want to insert a chart, a line chart or a column chart. We call it line or column or bar chart. Just click and use any type of a charts that you want. I will choose this for example, okay. So you can, I can drag it down a little bit like this. Uh, so you can use a chart uh, to compare the data. You can use a chart to compare data easily. How I will know? Once I look at this chart, I can know that the most days on January, it was cloudy, as you can see. Next, it was snowy. 
then sunny and rainy is the last one okay this is why uh, you can create a chart not only the column we have many kinds of a chart to compare data okay thank you use it and apply it